Hello and welcome back to the channel. I am your host, Sergeant Sim Racer. You join me for round three of the Group 4 Club 73 Esports Championship. Um, this is at Dragon Trail. So, a very nice circuit indeed. Enjoyed this one. Now, then, this video is only about five minutes long. Let's just say that's because all the action is in the first few minutes. So, as we take our rolling start, Bear in mind at this point, I've actually only had 10 minutes on this track, like, in the game entirely. So we, we follow 11th place around for a bit. We start in reverse grid order, so not too bad. Quite happy with that. We seem to be making some progress. Like I say, bear in mind I have had very little practice at this point. There's our, uh, our I say one of our many old sparring partners there, Curly, up front. As we come into the, what would you call this, the final kind of double apex left hand of the, the hairpin, things all get a little bit squirrely, so we, we make up a bit of a place there. Someone rage quitting, disappearing. Well, I assume they rage quit anyway, because I didn't see him again after that. And the, I think that was a, an orange BMW. The uh, Lexus looking as, as splendid as usual. So a very interesting track this, I'm not normally a fan of the um, sort of fictional circuits but this one, I, I could get to like this circuit, just just need a bit more bit more time in it, a couple more hours would be nice. Through some very awkward S's, just could not suss a line through there, that Lexus is a, uh, yeah not the friendliest of cars. Right so we skip forward, because we're in be reverse grid order so the fast boys are obviously coming through now. I'm doing nothing but holding them up. Batter's there, flashing his lights at me, telling me to get my chubby butt out of the way. As we go into the bottom hairpin, still holding on. As Batter's in that Buckmore Park liveried McGann makes his way through. Fair play, he's a much, much faster driver than I anyway, so no point in holding him up. Now struggling with understeer. Oh. As console gaming there goes through. So probably pushing a little too hard in all the wrong places. Fast boys there just streaming away. I'm probably sitting somewhere now around about where I should actually be, irrespective of reverse grid lineups. So we come into the Double Apex left-hander for the second time this race. Oh, once again, Carnage has somehow tried to go around the outside of Curly. Not only do I make it stick, I make us skittle my way through. And I've held place. Okay, this is looking good. Quite enjoying this at the moment. Console there, giving me a little squeeze, Let me know he's there. Then it, it all just goes Pete Tong from here on in. Yes, yes, that is the black and white screen of death. Ah, oh, just that little tap, that tiny little tap. I just tried to hang on to the car so it doesn't spin. Whoa, straight into the barrier. Boom, and darkness does become your old friend. Once more, from another angle there, the slightest nudge was just enough. I had absolutely no comeback from that. That was it. Look at this. Look, tiniest little knock. Boom. I instinctively, or reflexively, I should say, just try and stop her from spinning. Definitely by this point going way too quick. Hard on the anchors. Obviously understeered. Straight off the track. Bounce from one barrier. Bounce into the other. Nothing I could do about it. So from there on in, I literally circulate in 14th. I do a one stopper. See how fast they do this pit stop? Boom, look at that, rapid. Yeah, it was a one stopper for me. Nothing happens till very last knock-ins. I was thinking, let's get around, let's not get lapped. So, yeah, that right hand indicator's on as I get lapped by none other than batters. Good man, good show from him. Lovely lead he built himself there. And just before we run out of fuel, 
We crossed the line in a lowly 14th. Well, needless to say, that wasn't my best performance, but as always, thank you for watching, and I look forward to seeing you next video.